Hey guys, Smoke Tech area, and I just received the Antutu benchmark update. <clears throat> so first, they well, they got a new logo and a new uh, UI. So I'll zoom in on the logo here. So, uh, okay, I'm, why is it I'm always having focusing issues? Here, I'll do this. <clears throat> we can see it better this way. I don't know. But you, you should be able to see that, but they changed it a little bit. But <clears throat> let's turn, let's go up to into the. So I just installed the app on this phone because I didn't have it installed on my S4. I had it installed on my Droid Max, which actually, I actually cracked that phone. So I'll show you a video. But you can see this new UI here. Uh get this new type of background here in the <clears throat> people call it a hamburger or something like that but you have new stuff stuff like that you have ranking so you have like the galaxy note 5 you can compare it with your own phone but it says it says run a full test first so if i hit test it asks me to install 3D resources first. I don't know why they make that a separate app since it just forces you to do it anyways, but I'm gonna install this and I will come back to you when it's finished. So it just finished as I just like you probably saw it but uh didn't mean to do that. <clears throat> anyways uh this is it it took like a minute or two probably less so I'm going to hit test I saw they did some more uh, what is it called oh and you see first that they do the 3D test first now they have sound in here too Should I hope you able to hear that? Cause it's kind of quiet, even on max volume. Why is it blurry again? Are you serious? Whatever. There we go. Graphics aren't not that good at all. It says off screen rendering 1920 by 1080. Since I don't want to focus again. Garden. Loading. So I guess it's kind of cool that they do the 3D testing first because I kind of like look forward to 3D testing out of the other testing. So you can definitely see they changed the, uh, the whole 3D testing and 2D testing and stuff like that. Because before it just showed like jelly beans stuff like that. Show stuff like that. Image processing fish eye. Wonder why the dots on the camera is just like like it's moving or something when it's not. <clears throat> so I guess that's it for the 3D testing. So now it's doing the RAM. And there we go again with the dots. I don't know why. So I'm gonna just wait it out here. 
I would fast forward, but I imagine you probably want to see the whole update, what it does now. It, it shouldn't take that long. So, Antutu to Benchmark version 6.0. So, that's a new version. Because I know, like, in other reviews and apps and stuff like that, you guys been asking, like, what's the what's the version of this app for like my Google Play Store uh, review somebody asked the version of that so I just thought I'd put it out now version 6.0 so I got the update for the Play Store and get it from like Google or Google or anything it's just still just waiting here So we're at seventy percent. You see how it spins there too? I wonder why it's on green at here. Maybe because it's almost done. Who knows? It says my model number up here. SCHR970. Like I said in my other videos, this light is not on. It just does in the camera for some reason. Uh, it's that focusing issue again. There we go. I don't know why I have a lot of focusing issues in my videos. Like I'm always out here just like, eh, let me try to get this to focus. It's taking longer than expected. I don't want to touch it because that might affect the score if I'm just interacting with the phone. Now, and I wonder if they uh, improved the like stability in the app because I know for like some phone stuff like that, it tends to crash. Ninety nine percent, and there we go. And also, you get a uh, QR code so somebody can scan it. Uh, if I tap it, it does nothing. Three D twenty one twenty UX. Wow, that's kind of impressive. Well, to me it is. But yep. So. You could refresh this, I, I guess. Oh, QR code is the one being refreshed. So if we hit ranking, we'll compare it against uh, LG G4 or Google Nexus 6. So <laughs> the Google Nexus 6 just blows away the Galaxy S4. So if we see how Samsung progressed uh, with their Galaxy light up, that really blows it away and I see nothing that makes the Galaxy S4 any better than the Galaxy S6 in these scores nope I see nothing so yep uh, if I go to info I just get my the phone info uh, and then for news, you just get that, and we get HTML5 test, which is in the internet, and to officer, I don't know what that is, but apparently it's, it's also a separate app, oh, that's always been a separate app, but, 
I don't know what this search is all about. Oh, you can search for phones now for the scores, I guess. But, um, yep. So, I guess that does it. We hit about, check update. It's gonna say it's the latest update. Yep, there we go. And then there's that new logo I showed you. I think it's pretty cool. It's just the bunny in a fire, like the other one. Uh, but yeah, so I'll just show you the real quick the new Antutu update. I guess that's how you pronounce it. And that's also the Galaxy S4 uh, benchmarking, I guess. On Gal or on Android 5.0.1, I believe. Let's check. So. Android 5.0.1, so I was right. So, yep. But anyways, yep, I'm done here, so I'll see you in the next video. Bye.